Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy T, and I got the Tuesday team with me. Hey there. And we're coming to you with another episode of On The Hunt. You know, the weekly web series where I tell you the hot books we got at Saddle City. Now I gotta start this video off like I start all the videos off by saying, you know, this isn't really investment advice. This isn't really financial advice. You know what I mean? We're just trying to get you some of the hot books to cover price. It's all for fun, so please don't spend your rent money. Another point of this video is to share information with each other, share information with me. I don't know what you're getting. I may want to get it. Day is young. It's the best day of the week. Comic day. So let's get right to it. We're gonna get right into the books, but before we do, I gotta remind you guys, as always, to please like, subscribe, hit the bell, do all that good stuff. Uh, make sure you check us out on Comic Hub, you know what I mean? You can play Wednesday Warrior from your couch, you don't really have to rush in and get all these hot books we're talking about. Uh, make sure you sign up, up under us for that. Uh, make sure you check us out on eBay, Facebook, we have all that kind of stuff going. But without further ado, let's get to some books. So the first book I'm gonna pick up this week is one just for the cover, and that is Batman 84. Matina's baby, I mean, there's doesn't really matter. It's not for cover price anymore. They all are, but still pretty cool Batman. It kind of reminds me of the vein of a Batman dam. Uh, next book I'm going to pick up, again, just for the cover. It's kind of a small week, so I just picked some books. Uh, Black Cat number seven, the Venom Island variant. I don't know, it's just kind of a cool, dark cover. I like the way Venom looks in it. It's all right. Might grab that. Uh, next book I'd pick up is Buffy the Vampire Slayer, number 10. This is supposed to be the first appearance of a new uh, Slayer, so that might be something cool to pick up. Next book I'd pick up is just a, like kind of an indie number one, and that is The Butcher of Paris, number one. Uh, I don't know, sounds like it could be a murder story, something like that, some sort of serial killer thing. I haven't read the solicitation, gonna try it out anyways. Uh, and then next book I'm going to pick up is Deathstroke number 50, another Matina cover. Matina's baby. Uh, I really like this one. I think it's a nice cover. Going to pick that up for sure. Next books I'm gonna pick up are Ghost Rider, number one. Uh, I'm just gonna pick this up because, again, it's a $20.99 book. It looks pretty cool, Ghost Rider looks pretty cool on it. Can't wait to see how he is $20.99-ified. Uh, next book I'm gonna pick up, and a good other one just for the cover is Harley Quinn, number 68, Frank Cho variant. I just like the classic Harley, uh, kind of a holiday kind of theme. Looks pretty cool. Next, next book I'm going to pick up is Infected Deathbringer, number one. Uh, this issue, Donna Troy becomes infected with the Batman Who Laughs Toxin. I'm not sure if that's going to really make it her first appearance or who... I'm not really... Who is on the cover of this? That's the uh, Donna Troy. Oh, that's the Donna Troy? Well, then she does look cool, so going to grab that one. That's a homage to a movie poster, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, is it not? Like, it's some, yeah, Platoon. I knew it was a war movie. Um, and then the last book I'm going to pick up this week, definitely my favorite title of the week. This is not something that I'm making up on my own. This is the true name of the book, and that is Kill Whitey. And one of the, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, and one of the reasons why I can't wait to grab this is because I guess this was optioned or picked up by High Note Pictures. So we got a little bit of a movie tie-in with their great title. You never know, cool indie book. Going to grab that for sure. Next books I'm going to pick up are The Magnificent Miss Marvel number 10. This is the first Storm Ranger, which is a Kamala sentient suit or something like that. I haven't been reading the book, so I'm not 100% sure exactly what it's about, but first appearance nonetheless. I think Ella Venom. She had oh. a suit, it left her, and now it's a new character. Oh, okay, cool. Hey, uh, the next book I'm going to pick up is an oversized issue with a really cool Joker cover called New Year's Evil. Again, sometimes I can be a sucker for these holiday books. I'm into them, but I'm not, but still going to check it out. Might have some cool stuff happen in it. 
Next book I'm gonna pick up is uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles meet Mighty Morphin Power Rangers? Or is it the other way around? Mighty Morphin meets Teenage Mutant, I don't know. This cover doesn't have the title on it because it is the helmet cover. This is kind of homaging and reminiscent of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, like the first series they had the six helmet covers. Pretty cool, might grab one of those. And to go along with that, we also have, I'm just trying to show it, I mean it might not be that available, but the 1 to 25 of it, really nice, dark cover. One Helmet looks store. really cool, one per store, sorry. So that's really neat. Uh, next book I'm gonna pick up, another one just for the cover. Like I said, kind of a small week, so I'm just picking up some cool stuff. And that is Spawn, number 303, Matina's baby. Uh, I like this Matina cover, I really like what he does with Spawn. I really. Last but not least, I'm gonna finish off with a couple books. One book I was surprised I could even pick up, but I'm pretty sure I could pick up The Hammer too, and that is Thor the, I'm just kidding. Well, not really. really? Uh, that is Thor the Unworthy, number one. Uh, this is just a one shot with all the legendary Thor creators. Something pretty cool, looks like it has a lot of the different Thors in it. Gonna check that out for sure. Uh, next book I'm gonna pick up is Venom 2099, number one. I'm gonna pick up the regular cover first, not only because you got a really cool black cover, Venom 2099, number one, you know what I mean? It's also the first appearance of the second Venom 2099, a character named Aaliyah Bell, so it's the first female Venom, and that is why, to go along with that, I'm also gonna grab this Venom 2099 variant where you get her right on the cover. So not only with the variant, I mean, it's not the A cover, but they were pretty smart because they package the first appearance and the cover appearance on the variant, so it kind of forces me to get both, and I will get both. Um, last thing I'm gonna get this week is X-Men number three, and I'm just gonna get it for this cool kind of Alex Ross-esque cover. I'm not 100% sure if it is Alex Ross. It really looks like his art, but it doesn't look like his coloring. Uh, either way, really cool. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna pick that up for sure. Well guys, that's gonna do it for another episode of On The Hunt. You know, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, hit the bell, do all that good stuff. Uh, make sure you check us out on all social medias. We got Facebook, we got Instagram, we're on eBay. And don't forget to sign up for Comic Cup as well. If you don't want to really play the Wednesday Warrior, kind of wake up early, wait in lineups, you can buy the books right from your phone. And when you come to, in here to pick them up, you can even check out our new sign. You know what I mean? We're official store now. So we got the nice neon sign. Uh, I'd love to stay in chat with you guys, but time is ticking. Got to get my butt out there and get these books. Hope you guys have good luck getting these books still. See you next week. Peace.